Following the Viziv 7 concept that signaled Subaru's intent to produce a new three-row crossover, this Ascent concept moves the plan closer to reality. As we previously reported, the forthcoming Lafayette Indiana-built vehicle will carry that name into dealerships. The Ascent makes a bold visual statement highlighted by a front end that features the brand's Kanagi daytime running light design and a massive grille, while the overall proportions remind us of the recently introduced Volkswagen Atlas. But whereas the Atlas's aero straight character lines emphasize that vehicle's boxiness, the Ascent wears more flowing lines that imbue it with somewhat more grace. As do all Subaris save for the BRZ sports car, the Ascent will come standard with all-wheel drive. An all-new turbocharged 2.4-liter flat-four engine with direct injection will provide the power. Although Subaru isn't ready to talk technical details, we'd be surprised if the Boxer engine didn't at least equal or exceed the Mazda CX-9's turbo inline force 250 horsepower rating. Expect Subaru to employ a continuously variable automatic transmission as the middleman between the engine and the drive wheels. Home, News, Subaru Ascent Concept, Previewing Subi's 3-Row SUV, Official Photos and Info Official Photos and Info Subaru Ascent Concept, Previewing Subi's 3-Row SUV Looking to continue the brand's own Ascent APR 2017 by Greg Fink Share Tweet Following the Viziv 7 concept that signaled Subaru's intent to produce a new three-row crossover, this Ascent concept moves the plan closer to reality. As we previously reported, the forthcoming Lafayette Indiana-built vehicle will carry that name into dealerships. The Ascent makes a bold visual statement highlighted by a front end that features the brand's Kanagi daytime running light design and a massive grille, while the overall proportions remind us of the recently introduced Volkswagen Atlas. But whereas the Atlas's aero straight character lines emphasize that vehicle's boxiness, the Ascent wears more flowing lines that imbue it with somewhat more grace. As do all Subaris save for the BRZ sports car, the Ascent will come standard with all-wheel drive. An all-new turbocharged 2.4-liter flat-four engine with direct injection will provide the power. Although Subaru isn't ready to talk technical details, we'd be surprised if the Boxer engine didn't at least equal or exceed the Mazda CX-9's turbo inline force 250 horsepower rating. Expect Subaru to employ a continuously variable automatic transmission as the middleman between the engine and the drive wheels. VI dimensionally, the Ascent concept is smaller than the massive Viziv 7. The wheelbase is down by 0.7 inch to 117.0 inches, and overall length shrinks from 204.7 inches to 198.8. If they carry over to production, those figures would put the Ascent within spitting distance of the VW Atlas, which sits on a 117.3 inch wheelbase and stretches 198.3 inches in length. The interior is swathed in brown and white leather and absolutely littered with screens, even the window switches have been replaced by screens. Because everything is better as a touch screen, pull back the concept car facade, though, and it's clear the production Ascent's interior will be in many ways a double XL version of the new Subaru Impreza's. Interior storage space appears plentiful, with a covered cubby just under the infotainment screen, a pair of cup holders between the front seats, and a large center console. Meanwhile, a pair of second row bucket seats combines with a third row bench to bring total seating capacity to 7. Subaru has yet to announce when it will unveil the production ascent, but we shouldn't have to wait long, as the car maker says its three row crossover will go on sale sometime in 2018.